Today I'm going to be working on the Volvo 940 SE that I recently got. I also have the 740 and 240 that's not here today. So, first things first, you need to get your car up in the air, but how? Um, well, the factory jack points on these are actually rather nice. There is one jack point. I removed the, the splash pan, but there is one jack point in the center that I will show you right there. That is right in front, well, right actually in the middle of the engine. So that's the first jack point. My 7 Series doesn't have this because somebody removed it. But it is um, it's essential to make sure it's there, otherwise you will be jacking up from the steering rack, which will probably damage it. The next jack points are set up right here in the front and right here in the back. This car doesn't have a frame reel that goes all the way up to the front of the car, so do not jack on this point right here. Because with other cars that I've seen, and also with one of my cars, I have bent it. And it's not too hard to bend out, but save you some time and some pain to not do that. So, those are the middle jack points, which I usually put the jack stands on. And then you have your back jack point, which is the frame here. You can see this one isn't a solid rear axle, it's a uh, IRS car. So with these, you can jack from, I guess, any of those, the whole subframe in the back, or the rear diff. And with the wagon, which is a solid rear axle, I just jack from the center of the solid rear axle. So... That is the conclusion for this video. Pretty simple, but you'd be surprised how many people inject these cars up improperly.